What is going on guys, welcome back to the channel for the super quick video. In relation to my last videos regarding about defense, now we'll be talking about the difference between steals using a right stick and square button or X button if you're on Xbox. This one here came from a comment request, so just let me know in the comment section any recommendation for a topic, so now let's get right into it. So first, let's find out how these controls work. Like what animations can these controls trigger? So I tried to play around with it and here are the things that I found out. First one, in terms of passing lane steals, holding right stick to the right, to the left, down and pressing square button are just the same. There's a bit of randomness sometimes, but for the most part, the game will just give you the animation pointing towards the passing lane. In here you can see, that's the passing lane and I was just pressing square Holding right stick down, left and right, I was just mixing it up and it was really consistent that it'll just reach out towards the passing lane. There will be rare times though that it'll go to the other direction. I know some of you guys probably have the impression that flicking right stick to the right will make you reach out to the right side and vice versa, but that's not how it works. Left, right, down and square will be the same thing on passing lanes. Now, what about on on-ball steals? It is pretty much the same thing, right stick to the left and right and pressing square button are just the same. It will just randomly use left or right hand. In here, I was just flicking right stick to the right and everything is just random. Now, the only difference though is when doing on ball steals, flicking right stick down will have its own animation. It's like a swipe down animation. Now I might ask, shoots, then what's the difference between the swipe down steal and normal steals? I actually had a quick test and based on my results, swipe down steals are better on close contact steals than square button. The gap is not too big though. And by the way, I haven't tested this part yet, but I really assume that swipe down steals will be better when stripping layups or dunks because that's close contact as well and the motion is really for that type of steal. So now for the recommendation, of course it still depends on your playstyle, but for me personally, for the most part, I still think that pressing square will still be the best move for most players. So you don't need to think about it too much and you can just focus on some other things. But if you don't mind, like you can really think quickly and move your thumbs from the stick to the buttons and back and forth, then using right stick down on close contact steals will be better. So let me know in the comment section what do you think about it. Are you using these controls or are you planning to use these controls now that you know that it's better on close contact steals? So that's all for the video. If you guys like it, please smash that like button and please consider subscribing for more videos. And don't forget to drop by the channel for lots of other contents. And as always, stay safe and happy gaming, guys. Peace.